about it, no matter what we do, we talk about it. Just so you know. Because Kim just showed up as a videotaping, we're not talking anymore. <laughs> and I have been candid, so with you, and we've had a good, honest conversation. And because he's here now, videotaping, we're not talking anymore. So I have to walk. Away. Thanks for saving me the time because it's You're just not the same place as it always yeah. does. And, which is no and every too bad time you catch, too bad you catch. Every time he does show up, every blah, time he does blah, show blah, up, blah, you start blah, acting blah, differently. Blah, blah, blah. No, I'm acting the same way. Oh, you know what? That's really disgusting. What you just did. That's called social stigma. She hasn't changed a bit. You have. As soon as I showed up, you started saying you can't talk Mr. because Hines? you'd be busted Mr. on Hines? film. Your Mr. Hines, Mr. Cockle, I you, was speaking and you interrupted uh, me. You're, you're right, you I just did. Interrupted because me. it's not worth talking to you. I'll okay, tell you well, that right walk now. Walk away, walk away, walk away. I'm here doing walk something. Walk away. What are you doing? I'm looking after the staff here. Great. Well, then just ignore That's me. That's what I'm doing. So right uh, now, you're uh, interrupting me. You just stopped me. the conversation yeah. that was occurring. You interrupt. That's what it's called. Look at that, eh? Honestly, but Mr. Hannah, honestly, he comes around and he says that on film. He says that as soon as I come around, you change. I'm not doing either. But who changed? Just <laughs> the camera's on now. That's why. Standing by while they do it. So what's happening? I'm standing there, protecting the employees while we steal our goods out of the from our secure storage. Can you say that again? He's helping the uh, employees or protecting the employees while they steal our goods from our secure storage. You know what? So Stephen's on his way for your, your meeting at 10. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he'll be here at 10. So, okay. perfect timing. So, what are the things that. Mr. Cockle said that he can't say on film. I don't know, I joined the conversation yeah, so here uh, I love it, a few minutes before you showed up, so. Anna, I'll be able to answer that. Hey Anna, I'm just wondering, what was uh, Mr. Cockle saying before I showed up that he didn't feel he could say on film? Oh, just running around in circles as usual, that, you know, that, uh, oh, it's, it's our job to, be, to speak up about the abuse. Clearly not even supposed to happen a fire unsafe building. Are you kidding me? Double magnet doors with one fucking point of entrance. You know, we had the, in a situation where we've been saying since the beginning that if you corner somebody in a building, not only is it psychologically damaging and likely to cause more incidences of escalation, right? But eventually it will end up with something getting on their hand and causing harm to somebody. Now, why would they put us into a situation where that is the case. What's happening here now, the, behind me? Nothing. No, behind you, that's that's them throwing out our stuff as usual, which they have not allowed us to go downstairs and claim for, for a very long time now. Yeah. Oh wow, you know what's really surprising about that whole uh, pile there? They're, they don't inform us about that, but yet they talk in the little office with the window closed, like we can't hear them. Oh, and in the courtyards where mm -hmm. it echoes throughout the entire side of the building they're on about our personal business. They mm -hmm. actually talk about things they either see on camera or we've confided in them. Yeah. Yeah. The fact that they promised us secure storage, we believe in them, we put it down here, and yet the police protect them, not right. us.
nothing. There's no accountability to anybody. I can't see you. Yeah, they're in, the, the PHS is in contempt of... Uh, this uh, is the divide and rule they did in Ten City. Just so you know, this is perfect. Think about it. When I showed up, he goes like, oh, I can't talk anymore because Mr. Kim Hines showed up. I, uh, you know, he, you change when, you, when he comes. And, of course, he's the one who changed. This is what they did at Ten City. They'd come and go, oh, I'm not speaking in front of Kim Hines. That's like when I was filming their June 8th raid on Ten City that we're in OPC about right now. Um, you know, think about that day. Anyways, the divide and rule bullshit. You would think that policing dollars would be spent better uh, busting these, all these gangs are around here instead of looking over our goods for steel. Biggest gang in the world. Oh. <laughs> I got. I have a therapy appointment this time. Need to do a workout for him. <laughs> this is the build-up. So we were just talking about having solidarity with this Perry's hauling and junk removal, because this is the company. Sorry, this is the company that's getting used to take the stuff.